Okay, I thought what we would do today is get into a little bit of the, we're still going to kind of stay into the folk art theme, but we're going to kind of get into more of a, uh, a miniature type work. What I mean is that a lot of people don't like to do large things. They just want something they can hold and, and a lot of our projects are a lot bigger than normal. And some are small, but I like the miniature work. I always have. Um, it's a great afternoon project that we can uh, can do and, and have fun doing. And so I thought we would do... I have seen these around. I've seen these uh, um, in books and things. Uh, it's the little fishing cat is what they are called the little fishing cats and I drew a little pattern from the the picture that I saw and this is pretty similar what he looks like now there's a lot of different variations of this this little project but we're gonna carve one today and uh, I wish I had a picture to give you but I don't have a picture of it but I know you've seen him actually these are more Indonesia type carvings but uh, to me they look a lot like folk art and um, so we're going to do that today we're going to do a um, little fishing cat it's a little shelf sitter kind of like it sits on your shelf or you can build a little bench for it or whatever sit on your desk or whatever and uh, these are really cute they really are so and if you want the pattern, I, I, I can, I've drawn out a pattern. You can just send me your email. If you, if you need a pattern, send me your email because what happens is um, a lot of places that you can't put pictures on it, but email you can. So, uh, and then I can send you the pattern. So all you have to do if you want a pattern is just send me your email. That's all you have to do. And I'll be glad to send you whatever patterns you want or whatever. So, um... All right, now here's the, it's a little, the little uh, fishing cat is what it's called. Now, this is one and three quarter inches by about four inches. This is only about four inches long. It's more than the miniature uh, basis. And what I'm going to do, I oh, dropped my, I don't know what I dropped. I'm sorry. Excuse me. I dropped my knife cover. I want to start off first of all by in the in the uh, this is going to be its ears up here. So I'm going to start kind of bringing this down just a little bit. just like that see and now what what is going to happen is the face actually comes forward it actually comes to like a point almost so let's go ahead and just very lightly remove a little of this face forward these are wonderful projects because these are afternoon projects that you can do they're fun, um, not difficult. Now, most of these little cats, they're painted real, real um, uh, different colors. I don't know. I'm sure a lot of you have seen them. They're painted some really bright colors and stuff like that. See? Let's continue to remove a little bit of the ears here. And we kind of go at an angle here because the 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 ears are gonna kind of come out like this, in other words. 
just like that. See how they come through here? Okay. Get on each side. We kind of round this off just a little bit. There's not a lot of detail in this. It's just kind of a See how the rounded back goes? It's not, not difficult. A lot of rounding off in this, in other words, more of a, more of a rounding off purpose than uh, anything. Okay, now see. Now we're going to go ahead and from this point on we're going to kind of bring this around like this. We're just going to, we're not going to do a lot, but we're going to sort of just make an indention in here where the head sort of separates from the, from the body. Just like that. Just like that. Not not big thing, but just sort of a little separation. Here. Okay. Now let's continue to round this head. Excuse me, not round the head, I'm sorry. Bring this face forward. Sometimes I mess up here when I'm talking. And do it from side to side, as you see. You, you want to do it from side to side. You don't want to... Um, and see how it kind of makes a cone type. Um, Okay, see that? See how that kind of makes just sort of a cone type uh, way.